I've got a lot of development boards for a variety of purposes. And this is just a few of them. Because sometimes I don't want to you know, track down the right board, set it up, maybe load an operating system on it, get the proper development environment set up, just to do a quick circuit prototype. So for those cases, I made this. I call it USB GPIO. And it adds Python programmable GPIO pins to any modern computer via USB. It's programmed with a Python library that I developed, so let's take a look at that. I think one of the best ways to demonstrate something is uh, through a quick example. So let's uh, plug in a simple circuit. We're going to do a blinking LED. So we will attach this to the ground pin of USB GPIO, and the other pin will be one of the GPIOs. Right, and then with that hooked up to our computer, I'm going to go over to Python, and I've got this simple example uh, set up right here already. So I'm just gonna modify it slightly for this use case. So first you would just import the US GPIO library into your Python application, create an object telling it where the serial device is, um, and the speed that you're gonna communicate at. And then the rest of it probably looks pretty familiar from other development tools that you're familiar with. So you can set the direction of a pin. In this case, we only have an output, so we won't need this input. And then within this loop, I'm going to set one of the pins high and low in a loop uh, with a little bit of a delay so that we can see it happening. And we don't need this digital read anymore either. So I'm going to save this and then just uh, execute the script. And we should see the light turning on and off once every second. And there it goes. So uh, obviously you can write much more complicated um, applications than this to do uh, more interesting things, but you're essentially gonna use the same techniques of uh, writes and reads of pins to accomplish the goal. So this is a good starting point, just blinking an LED. I've taken the back of the device off to give you a quick look at how it works. So inside, it's pretty simple. There's an Arduino Nano 33 IoT development board, and the pins on that are connected to this header on top of the device. And these are in turn controlled by the Python library, which communicates with that Arduino via a serial connection over USB. If you want more details, I have everything written up in a GitHub repository. I will uh, put this link in the show description. And you can see there's a pretty good amount of detail. So if you are just interested in this or you would like to try building your own unit, it uh, should, shouldn't be too hard to do. If you have any suggestions for future enhancements to the device, or if you're building your own, I'd just be interested to know that. So please comment and let me know. Uh, and thank you for watching the video. I appreciate it.